hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And as I was recording some of the last few Queen Monica Proto Man series stages, I came across some stages that were popping up here that were really funny sounding. Like this one, Every Bad Level in a Nutshell by Dest the Robot Master. Okay. So let's see. <laughs> let's see what this is going to be like. With a title like this, you have to go do it. Okay, we've got our enemy spam. We're. We're getting out of here. Oh gosh. Oh, bad screen transitions. Yup. That's normal. Super enemy spam. I mean, I know we have other weapons. Conveyors, like non-stop conveyors. Big empty rooms. Oh my goodness. That's not... Get me out of here. Oh, am I going down here? I'm going down here. Yep, that was uh, every bad level in a nutshell. We somehow got through there without dying. You know, I'm actually... It was kind of amusing. I'll give that a thumbs up. Halloween Scary Castle. We'll, we'll come back to that. There was something else... I saw. Yeah, these two stages... Magnet Man Remake by Nintendo Dude 82. I'm curious, you know, we've, we've always had this discussion about remakes versus replicas. And so let's see just how much of a remake this is. This should be like a total reimagining of the stage, not just, hey, let's copy the complete layout of the stage and just replace some things that, you know, we didn't otherwise have. We have Ice Slasher instead of Spark Shock. If it's. Uh, Shadow Blade, Gemini Laser. We don't get these weapons enough anymore. Okay, the layout is slightly different, but what we're doing is still largely the same. Okay, there were not enough magflies in that section. Oh, this is where we would be battling Proto Man. Proto Man. This is looking like an eyesore. Might need some laser eye surgery soon. Hey, we got more magflies in this stage. That's cool, I like that. I mean, I'm not letting them do their thing. I'm not really letting anything do its thing. That's that's not Needle Cannon. Why do I even want Needle Cannon? It's terrible in this. I'm about to have issues. Laser eye surgery can fix that. Underneath, that's really interesting. There's magflies coming to screw me up. I can bounce on them, can't I? Oh no, not you. Punch in the face! We have that ability, and I have not even mentioned it yet. Punch that Sniper Joe in the face. Oh, oh my. I don't know if we've hit a checkpoint yet, have we? Otherwise, I would have tried, like, top spinning on that guy and using the bounce to get back up to the platform. That would have looked really cool.
But yeah, not gonna risk that. There's our checkpoint. Okay, so this is definitely a reimagining of Magnet Man stage. Oh, we're back outside. Can I try it? Yeah, it didn't work well. <laughs> I'm glad I waited to try that. Okay, you leave me alone. Snakes are finding usefulness. Of course, I know pretty well how to deal with magflies. I don't know how to deal with that guy down there. Can't quite punch him in the face. Well, ha! I punched him in the face. Punch that Sniper Joe in the face already. I know I gotta get above his shield. Alright. You're bothering me. You're bothering me. Shadow Blade just wants to be the best weapon in this stage. We didn't have that Yoku Block section. We don't have the Magnet Pullers, though you could have substituted... You could substitute, like, some fan fiends for that, although that's kind of the opposite. Or just have them, like, I don't know. I don't know, you, you know what I mean. Okay, well, he should be weak to this. He's technically weak to Spark Shock, which is Ice Slasher here. We just have generic Magnet Man, which I guess that's okay, because it's a remake. I, I slashed him through his thing. Okay. I slashed through his thing. That was a good remake. We'll give that a thumbs up. And one more stage. Go back. One more stage I want to check out this El Tren... Okay, I'm, I'm definitely going to screw this all up. El Tren de Armamento de Vortex Capulatio 1 by Le General. I just want an excuse to do that again. Uh, it's actually by Mr. Taco Boy, who's secretly Le General. El Tren de la Carmitano Vortex, we need special weapons, cartos. I don't even think we're not even going to get that. Interesting. Though, when you don't have other things present, we can just kind of run by it. Oh, jeez. We don't put these enemies in a stage without special weapons to contend with them. This is... I don't like those enemies. This is reminding me... A lot of like slash beast type of thing type of a train ride with all those containers that uh, can be destroyed quite the variety of enemies Almost too much variety of enemies. Oh, really? Do we have to have, like, every big enemy? We need Big Eye now. We're gonna have a Big Eye army. I don't think we've had consistent enemies on the Train de la Carte. Okay, maybe there's been a couple repeats. Oh, no, cat's on a train. Cat's on a train. All the snakes are on the plane, but the cats are on the train. like to see a little bit more out of the level. Maybe it was lacking kind of a stage gimmick. 
It had the aesthetics, it had way too many enemies. Lack of special weapons for dealing with some of the enemies. Lack of a... oh, hey. We're not done yet. What is the point of that? If all you were going to do is have us climb a ladder and grab the thing, why not just end it with the Charge Man boss fight? I didn't do anything too offensively bad other than using those big bulky enemies and not giving us special weapons. And not really having a stage gimmick, but it wasn't it wasn't bad enough to thumbs down. So with that, I will see you guys next time.